Greetings, lords and ladies, Kanji here, and welcome to another episode of our Nova Monumenta Japonia Historica in Crusader Kings 2. Now, when last we left off, we had gone to a holy war and began taking as much of the uh, Hokkaido Ainu lands as possible. We are, of course, continuing that in this episode. Let's see. Put him in jail. Good, 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 good. Yes, more ransoms. Very nice. Uh, they're actually heading straight for our retinue, so let's just follow them. Actually, before following them, split off half of our force there. Excellent. Uh, this way we do keep sieging down. I accept to swear fealty, but who is you? Oh, hello. Ah, and this guy was the previous one that joined us. So these guys are just randomly joining us as vassals, even though we're nowhere near them with our armies. And you belong under that. Lovely. I usurp, cannot usurp the sole primary title of a ruler of another religion who holds land within it. Aha! So we will still have to go to a holy war for all of that. Understood. Thank you very much. I was just slightly confused because I clicked too soon last time. I did not a Sakura Ono de Jure War over Echizen. Uh, okay. Oh, it has appeared Asakura Ono de Jure War. Asakura Kagetsune. You have an Asakura. Mmm, sure. And you're attacking or defending? Attacking. This guy over Echizen. Ah, I see. Echizen is indeed yours, and you want the rest of the land. I was unaware that he was actually not part of Echizen. I was also unaware that you actually made the Echizen a, a, a thing. We just gave him random land, but I guess he bought the claim? Wrestling claim. I, I forget what exactly was happening over there. I'm sorry, but yeah, Ono should have been given to him, honestly. You should also go and attack the Rokaku. <laughs> no, yeah, no, no, you really shouldn't be doing that. You really should not do that. There we go, and that is it. That's their entire army right there. Lovely. Um, so let's have these guys who are not our retinues. Get straight up there and start attacking those guys as well. Let's go. Uh, I accept swear. To, uh, I accept to swear fealty as. Who is you? Trying to. Oh, that little plot of land right there. Okay. So combine these guys. He accepts to swear fealty as well. Like that is already another piece of uh, land over here. <laughs> completely different duchy already. Uh, but sure, I'll take it. I'll take it. As many of you can, um, or rather, I hope as many of you swear fealty to me as possible. Yes, like that. Who are you? Hell yeah, just keep on coming. Keep on coming! I don't even have to fight and these guys are already swearing fealty to us. That's the best possible solution ever. Uh, though, of course, this solution can also turn against us. That's perfect. Actually has both of them. Though she is slow. Though considering she's slow, those are pretty good stats. All things considered. Offer peace and force demands. Of course. Uh, are all of these mine now? Yup. Okay, so we should be giving these to somebody. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Aha, you can't usurp it. Or rather we could. But we would need two more pieces of land. Hmm. I can't declare war against this guy, because he's a vassal of that. Uh, so we do need another person. Perhaps somebody that's good in... Stewardship. And is young. That's a young, good person. Let's invite him. Why stewardship? Well, because he's gonna take good care of the land, and is possibly going to. Your tribal vassal has adopted feudalism. Good. Y yes. Can I revoke this? 
He's a barbarian, so it's not gonna matter. Yay. Barbarian as well? Yes. Not gonna matter. How about you? Barbarian, it's not gonna matter. Lovely. How about you? Nope. You're apparently not a barbarian, and it is gonna matter. Somehow, some way. So this guy adopted feudalism. I thought he was already feudal. Strange. The guy hasn't come yet. It grieves you deeply. Yeah, I'm sorry. There we go. Wait, did the guy already arrive or has he not arrived? The person we invited, this guy. He accepts our gracious invitation. Excellent. Alright, so let's give you some new lads. Uh, Yoichi, for instance. That is now yours. Otaru as well. These lands all belong under this is your title, right? Stop scrolling all the way over there. Yes. Okay, good. Uh, next, what is that? I can't even read it. Takashima. Alright, so Grant... Takashima over there. There you go. Grant... Oshoro... I think is what that says. No. Oh, I can't. Can I revoke? I can. Excellent. Alright, so first I'll revoke, then I'll give it to you. I'll give them to you. Shakotan. There you go, that's yours. And... Bikini. That is also yours. Can you handle all of those? Oh, you can actually handle all of those. Lovely. But you're not going to be able to handle this one, apparently. I think. I believe. Okay, did I try to revoke your lands? I did. It was unsuccessful. Alright. Come on, you guys. And say bye-bye. I have a maximum of almost 34. That's pretty cool. Um, okay, so we took all of those lands, which belong to that. So that's yet another lord that we're going to have to invite. Let's go with uh, another person that's pretty good in... Sunatana Iberino High Chief. You're not one of mine. Wait. There we go. I was like, wait, why is a lord willing to actually join me? Uh, thir you're 38. Do you have an heir? You don't. So that's not a good idea. Okay, what about another commander or something? A strong individual. You would do. But you are also homosexual, so that gives your fertility a pretty big... dip. Um... <laughs> That's an 18. At 32 years of age, do you have a child? You do not yet have a child. Uh, what about this? Ah, he's got cancer. He's gonna die soon. Um, we're just trying to select somebody. Gunmano Gunbugyo. Yeah, I know, but he's 64. He's gonna die in no time. Tatsunaga uh, Imbano Commander. Sure, I'll... I'll... I'll take the chances of him still getting a child, possibly. Okay, so let me give you Tomamae. There you go. And Mashike. And that's it. These two are the lands belonging to that. You belong to that. Neither of which I can actually revoke. So I have to figure something out. That's another person right there. Another vassal. Perhaps a good diplomat. Um, 27... 
He already has a child. Certainly, invites a cord. Might as well. I humbly accept your decision to revoke to kill though it grieves you greatly. Yeah, sorry. Very good. Uh, there he comes, and I will give you Kamikawa. There. Okay, so we're set up. Uh, let me give you the land that I just took, which was something O. Oshoro. Boom. That is now also yours. There you go. Okay, so we set a, a, we have set up everything over here, so that as soon as we get all of these uh, duchies, we already have lords that are going to be the actual dukes over there. Uh, how much longer do we have the enforced peace? Almost two more years. Uh, okay, so next step is definitely just send our retinues over here and do a minor holy war, I believe, on these guys. Or do we just go for a straight-up holy war? Can I go for a straight-up holy war against this guy? Uh, declare war? I can't until December 16. Why is that? Is it the actual... is it actually the same guy? It's not. Why do we have a truce with you? Do I have a truce with you as well? I don't. So I can do a holy war for just all of that. And others might join in. Well, this guy is probably not going to join in. We just wrecked his entire army. I'm kind of upset that he's, we actually have a truce with him. He's 58, though, so he might actually die soon, which is good. For us, at least. Uh, bring the ships down here. Right over here, I think. We'll raise... How many do you have? 1,200. Okay. And where... You're the guy that has the 3,000, right? No. Where's the guy with the 3,000? You. Where are the rest of your lands? That's the only piece of land... No. Liege. Aha! So I can actually raise them over here as well. Much, much closer. Excellent. Alright, so just move these guys over here. Actually. And we will immediately embark upon another holy war. It's time against you for that. Let me just get the ships ready. Boom. There we go. Alright. Let's do this. Holy war. Bada beam. A bada boom. Get your boys in here. Get your boys ready. Actually, have them stay. Okay, they're on the ship. Let's bring in the rest. The peasants have risen up. What? The peasants have risen up in Sakai, led by a disgruntled former soldier. The rebels have the nerve to demand independence. Where? Again? Blasted traitors. Against... Oh, against the Ashikaga. Okay, that doesn't really matter to me. The Ashikaga can take care of that. Though it is in my lands. Chicago, take care of that. I can't be bothered right now. Um. Okay, anybody else joined in so far? No one. Alright, so this might actually be easier than I expected at first. There we go. The boys are back in town. Let's just start. Your long-term loyalty is marvelous, and now all in my clan know your achievement. I request it to the Imperial Court to grant you Shogoi no Ge in order to reward your achievement, and it was accepted. Oh, thank you. Oh, hey. Okay, so that's how we get these promotions. That's pretty good. Can I get a higher promotion as well? I wonder. I wonder. Alright, so, uh, if we consider all the facts here, we should be able to beat these guys very, very easily. They only have roughly 500. Though, granted, he does have some vassals that might be helping him from the main, from vassals. Um, wait a minute, it doesn't even say... Army levies, fleet levies. It doesn't even say the allied levies, interestingly enough. Are those the... Oh, those are the rebels, I see. So we can actually just squash the rebels. And get that piece of land 
immediately as well, has adopted feudalism. I'm glad you're adopting feudalism. Thought that was already a done deal. Okay, so you guys go forward and you guys attack them. Oh, somebody joined in. Aha! He's actually he actually came back in. Wow. Uh, child lacks focus. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. let's see. Uh, uh, heritage. Yes. Uh, my liege, I believe that one of your vassals can be discouraged. He's 32. We will do nothing for now. Uh, how are factions going? Factions are fine. I really want to just revoke that guy's land and give it to somebody else. He's annoying the living hell out of me. But let's keep it going. Quickly. Uh, call for my core physician at once. Yes, my son is in danger. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. There we go. Okay, so I'll split those as well. Just keep on going. Split these guys again. Keep them going here. Just carpet siege everything. Let's go. I doubt they're gonna be able to muster much of an army against us. Uh, okay, so this guy has already decided to join us. Good for you. Good for you. You're smart. You're not dumb. Good to know. Alright, attack them. Uh, another one. Got it. Alright, uh, just keep on going up. Committed seppuku, alright. Amazing, isn't it, that even these tribal people <laughs> know what seppuku is. Uh, there we go. Shogun has declared a Chicago Hishi vassalization war on this guy. Ah. Uh, interesting. But wait. Wait, he's an Ora. Lord, is he not? Oh, uh, slightly confused what's going on over there. At any rate, we'll just keep going. Uh, head straight in, yep. No, come on! I mean, he wasn't that good, but come on! Oh. Well, at least you're still alive. At 30 years of age. Hmm. Hmm, hmm. I mean, I'm 60. Thank God our health has been good. Split. Let's go. Keep it up. Oh, you're done. Didn't even notice that. Uh, took that. Excellent. We're at 97. Good. Took that. Keep on going up. We going up, up, up. We going up, up, up. Do we just try and take a bunch of their lands as well? Maybe some more people are gonna randomly uh, submit to us. We could try and do that. Even though we are already at 100%. Uh, what are the chances? Like, how many units do you need here? You don't need that many. Just split in half, move those guys there. You're almost done here as well. Just split in half again and send those guys into Soya. We're just gonna take everything. Nobody else is actually swearing fealty, interestingly enough. I guess we should just end it. Force. Okay. Get our guys home. So who was it that swore fealty? You're one of them. Revoke. Cannot. Part of this, though, so yeah. Sapporo, can I revoke you? I can't. Ishikari, Kabato, can I revoke you? Yes. 
Okay, you're the guy that we were preparing for this land over here. No, for that land. Mm-hmm. You were the guy that we were preparing for this? Yes, you are. Alright, so you get Uryu. Uryu, that's yours. What else belongs under your jurisdiction? This guy, who we cannot revoke from. So, right, so I can't give you that piece of land. Unless we create this for 164 gold. I don't see why not. Just create it. And give you the entirety of the clan and everything that belongs under it. Just like that. Boom. Congratulations. And you can just go and declare war against this guy if you feel like it. Take that land as well. And you. Can't create that yet. Okay, okay. We're fixing some border gores here right now. That's all I'm doing. Uh, one more year of enforced peace. Let's get our boys home. Your Majesty, tales of your misdeeds are told from Ireland to Cathay. Aha! <laughs> How do you know of these lands? I will not allow you to steal my tiles without a fight. You're no longer my liege lord. Okay. So... What happens now? I mean, you're his liege. I mean, he's the, your liege now, so it doesn't really matter to me. Nothing really matters. Anyone can see. Nothing really matters to me. What are we doing? 34. Excellent. Okay. Uh, can I just declare war for, like, the jure minor holy war for that? Yeah, looks good. Just do it. Send our units in here. Quickly take this. It's gonna be a quick one. Bada beam, bada boom. Offer enforced demands. Yay. Uh, and I'm gonna give you Sorachi. As soon as I find it. Oh no, sorry. Uh, transfer vassalage. There you go. That's yours. 314 units. Hopefully you get more than that. Uh, Sar is the next minor holy war that we can do. I can't do a giant holy war against you yet, can I? Nope, I can't do a holy war against you yet, can I? You're still the same guy, you're still the same guy. Um, can we do a holy war against this guy? We should be able to. Holy war for that part, or holy war for- oh, just that. Well, definitely this then. Though that's one, two, three... Four pieces of land? Yeah, four. Why are there two sods? Strangely enough. Huh. All right. Just gonna clean up here slightly. Declare war. Minor holy war for that, so nobody else has to join. Uh, oh, he already died. Darn. And he didn't come in and help, even though he is the suzerain. Did he? Nope. Okay, this is gonna be quick. Quick another piece of land, a message about request constant support. Nope. War for what? Shogun Mina no Kami Ashikago Jihad declared Ashikaga Holy War for I Utsi Unkuron. See? See? It's BS that I couldn't do that and he can. But sure, you focus on that, I'll focus on everybody else. Uh, did these guys... Oh, these guys now joined in on this one. <laughs> Don't worry. We're already done. Okay, so... That is now mine. Does this belong to you as well, or is this a new piece of land here? <gasps> it is a new piece of land. 
Can I take more of this piece of land here? Declare holy war. Or, yes, that part down there. Just immediately declare. Charge in. Let's go. And we will raise up the same two guys as we did previously. Raise! You don't hate me, right? Nah, you're a good guy. Here, hey, hey, here's a gift. Okay? Because you've been so good. That should upset the vassal levies race too long. Alright, Kosoji clan no daimyo. Alright. Their ships have been up for a very, very long time, so of course they're being upset about it. Um, you raise your army here. We'll pick up both of them. Oh, we've already taken part of it. Good. No, that's not what I wanted to do. That's not what I wanted to do. I wanted to split. Is that S? It is S. There. Move them over there. Okay, units on ship. Let's get the ships in place. Just immediately send you in. What is this? I have decided to institute Kingdom Vice Royalties Law and Decline. I'm not being suckered into anything dumb anymore. Anybody else at war? Nope. So you're standing alone. You stand alone against us. Can I raise some units from you? That's not going to be enough to kill them. Uh, what about in Kita? How many units do I have there? Not that many. I do have 541 gold. But I'm saving up for a war against the Orokaku that will be allowed in about 9 months. Let's just take the rest of the lands that we can over here. Alright, send these guys in. Beat those guys up. Uh, split in half again. Send them into there. You, you don't need the entire four sliders, so split these guys in half as well and just send them onto the ships first. And then from the ships, right there, take all the lands as quickly as possible. Anybody else? Ah, they're joining in. Hello. Hello. Damn, there's a lot of you. Okay, so we might have to call for a few more vassals to come in on this. Yep, plenty more are joining. And they still approved it, even though I didn't. Let me see, who else might we want to call in on this war? Uh, I mean, I can just send some of my own units from, like, Inaka or Tsugaru. Will probably be enough to beat these guys up. What's the situation here? Yeah, plenty of lords actually joined in. We'll see what the actual numbers are after we're done here. Oh my god, those guys are just gonna keep annoying us, huh? Just destroy that army. Now! Quickly! Probably gathering their forces, yep. Don't worry, let's just focus on taking these lands. There we go. Yes, 49% already. Let's keep it up. Keep it up. Oh, hello. That's a slightly larger force than I anticipated to see there. Oh, they're actually sending in more. Oh, hello. Yeah, let's, um... Bring some men from Tsugaru, shall we? Let's uh, bring them up here. Into Yufutsu, possibly. 4,000 units over there. I mean, we're taking most of what we want anyway. So combine these guys. Keep on going into Pior. I'm just gonna wait for uh, our morale to be slightly higher, and then we'll attack. There we go. Everyone's ready. We good? I think we're good. And we'll put the additional generals into this army as well. Attack! Send these guys in to help. 
So the Ashikaga managed to take most of that. Not all of it. Most of it. We'll see who he actually gives these lands to. But I am definitely going to be attacking that. <laughs> I am not allowing any border gore in Hokkaido. Hokkaido will belong to the Ora. Remember that. Okay, so the Rukaku are currently still in a rebellion. So that's good news for us. That is definitely good news for us. Alright, so we're on 91%. After this battle, should be at... Yep. 100. These lands are now ours, sir. So which... All of the plots are ours, so let's just send our guys in. Alright, so ships... Don't need you no more. Thank you very much. You've been a great help. Question now is, do we continue with the Holy Wars, or do we just prepare for the next five months for our war against the Rokaku? Honestly. Um... Sure. Osaru. Is that what we're naming this now? Monkey. <laughs> Alright. Wait, is all of this ours? <gasps> all of this is ours. Hell yeah, directly ours. So that means another lord has to be chosen. Uh, let's see. Who would be willing to join? You're dying of cancer. You're not very good. You're poor. I mean, you, Ora no Gunbugya? Don't we have a better Gunbugya? Ora clan no Gunbugya. Oh, so that's, guys, just the Oras. What? That is so weird. But you know what? I'll invite you. I'll invite you. Invite to court, and I'll give you your very own duchy. Let's create a title, Clan Teshio. So, you basically created a title I wanted to create there? Is that what you did? Can I ask you for a title? No, I can't because we got rid of that, didn't we? Oh, hey, carousing. Let's go into hunting. Back into hunting. Kra la la. Uh, all right, and we can settle the units down. This is a situation with our army 35k. Hell to the yes. Well, I mean, we can't do another holy war against these guys now. Is this guy dead yet? Nope, still the same guy, right? Yeah, what about that guy up there? Still the same guy there as well? Yo. Okay, so the only ones we can actually do a holy war against now is this guy. Um, let's just wait for that guy to arrive to our land. There we go. So, you are now the proud owner of... Uh, first and foremost, Saru. Where is it at? Saru. There you go. And can I just create this title right here? 174 gold. You know what? I'll do it. This is going to be so much easier. And we just grant you the entirety of the clan with everything under it. Bam. This is now yours. Enjoy. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Now it's time to get our retinues back home and ready to face the Rokaku, who we are going to go to war with for what? Can't see just yet. But I'm pretty sure that those lands belong under the Uzen, which belongs under the Kingdom of Dewa, which I am going to create now. Boom. So that entire thing is gonna belong to us as soon as we beat the Rokaku. And that's quite a large piece of land, if I do say so myself. Naturally, they have plenty more, so there's gonna be a bunch of wars against them. But if we manage to snatch that... who oh boy! I mean, it's not that strong. To be fair, it's not that big. It's not that strong. Like, it belongs to... Okay, I, we can't even see how many units he has only from this place because of his domain size being as large as it is. But we'll see. We'll see. But we'll see in the next episode, guys. Thank you very much for joining me. I have been Kaiser. 
I will see you guys next time. And until then, as always, if you like what I do, please do consider leaving a like, subscribe if you haven't yet, share these videos around, and I will see you next time. And also, can I just mention the fact that the guy, the Ashikaga Shogun, actually gave it to Hara Tatsunaga, the guy that we placed over here in um, Mashiken Tomamae and Kamikawa, I guess. There are two Kamikawas, what the heck? I mean, sure, sure. But yeah, he was kind enough to actually give this land to him. So, Oda, uh, I mean, the Oda are still the majority controllers of Hokkaido. And we will make sure that that continues. And all right, guys, thank you very much for joining me. I'll see you next time. And until then, Ad Gloriam.